by those who claim to know the thief. Did not the prophets of Israel before the Moshiach ben Yosef, before Christ in that first advent, did the prophets not warn their own people, Israel, of the consequence that was to come for disobedience to the Most High? And was this not based off the foundation of Torah, the blessings for obedience, the warnings against disobedience? The Lord Yahweh will bring you back in ships to Egypt. When we think of Egypt, like the traditional Egypt in which the Hebrew Israelites held in captivity over 400 years and now this spiritual Egypt also known as Mystery Babylon in these last days the Lord Ahia will bring you back in ships to Egypt by a route that I promised you would never see again this is a message people of all so-called skin color and race. Fast forward to present times in this spiritual Egypt, in this wicked Babylon system, where they use so-called actors and actresses and even those who sell their souls of all so-called race, both Hebrew Israelites, Jew or Gentile, these corrupt powers that be, these Satanists, controlled by the puppets and the puppet masters of white supremacy to divide and conquer. These puppets <laughs> that we call politicians, even so-called presidents. Just seems like I was here yesterday. <laughs> Give a man a face. Was actually born on crypto. And the majority of sheep are fooled again. Sent here to save and the again. planet Earth. So whatever puppet they could use, claim it to represent the culture of the people, of all people, to be somewhat patriotic to the satanic powers that be. Yeah. People buy into this shit pop culture, man. The pop stars that actually stand for something with real talent and genuine soul are the ones that are sacrificed in this matrix. Framed as drug overdoses and these satanic Illuminati sacrifices. And yet they persist in imposing upon his slight young frame. Illuminati in the Trayvon Martin case. The thing, Ja, did a lot of this double-edged sword this. called the Internet those of you that and don't YouTube. Know, one of the biggest secret societies, it's also referred to as the Black Skull of Bones, is the Boule Society. This is where your Al Sharpton, your Barack Obama, your Jesse Jackson, they've all come from this Boule Society. All these big names through the hip-hop industry. They Shit all hot. are entangled Commercial in rap this industry. satanic religion with these perverted sexual acts where they all do each other and they hold it as bribery, as blackmail on top of each other. This man, do you know That's who him. this man is? This is Trayvon Martin's father in Yes. Yep. He is That's him. an Illuminati Grand Master Mason of the Boule Society. Game over. Can you say sacrifice? Can you say set up? Sacrifice to Moloch. See what's going on here now? His own they're son. in full control. To deal they with use it. the mainstream media. And, uh, as we said before, they've allocated and lies in the pits of hell. Time in case things like this happen, along with so obvious facts, promote racism, free, uh, uh, hatred, all types of prejudice. In the meantime, divide and conquer. Don't go near this area, South Central Los Angeles at Florence. <laughs> Set up many explosives, a couple plane crashes, and to see the majority of their so-called weapons of mass destruction search 
for an unjustified war. And people of all so-called races and are different swinging? cultures are caught up in this shit. You know why these things happen in the nation. The Most High allows these corrupt powers to be. To bring corruption. Give us a sign to open our eyes and repent before it's too late. I wonder why these been things happen. Since about uh, three o'clock this morning, when each half hour it's gotten worse and worse. Satanic witch's face changed as these le legion of demons. The people still love their idols. In her face and in her eyes. They can't leave their idols alone. And then you have TV shows like American Idol. Pretty much spelled out there for you, right in front of your face. And there she is. It's time to wake up. People of all so called skin color, race, gender, nationality, culture, so called religion, philosophy, lack of. Time to wake up before it's too late, y'all. For a nation built off of genocide and slavery through white supremacy. Yo, there's a point where the racial division is relevant, and I'm saying people of all so called race and color need to repent, but certain uh, white people, Gentiles of flesh and blood that have some kind of privileged white bread mentality, you better repent before it's too late. Yes, the original seed of Israel was under a generational curse. Not all white people, many of us, according to flesh and blood, like myself, were descendants and are descendants of so-called indentured servants and even slaves on European soil, are these same white devils. However, those who want to make excuses for white supremacy saying oh that was a long time ago is there a guilty consciousness i mean are you sure that your white ancestors were rich slave masters i mean maybe so and if so repent but the curses upon the people of israel will be lifted up and brought upon the slave masters. White supremacy went way past the boundaries of Yahweh's curse, or that generational curse upon his own people. And universally through Yeshua, we're all called to be a spiritual Israel in that true body of Christ. So you must recognize that original seed. Restoration of Judah and Israel. I'm telling you, ladies and gentlemen, the globalists are accelerating their takeover plan because the world is waking up. Uh, and I repeat this every show now, just so you understand that you're not alone.